Turn that down. Let's get this move. So you see what we got here. Super plastic. You see all the board apes are up. So I wrote, so this isn't really an unboxing, unboxing video. This is more of a, I'm gonna show you my display video. I'm gonna keep my eyes, keep my eyes on the camera. So, me personally, I'm a, I'm a SP, I'm a super plastic holder. So I'll start with the super plastic, right? They did this drop, it was a, I don't remember how long, I think it was a half an hour window they gave you. So the day they dropped it, you had a half an hour to buy them and you could have bought as many as you wanted, I think. I think they did two at a time and you could have just kept going in there and buying them until that half hour was over. And me personally, this one was gated by the super plastic NFT. So you had to have a super plastic NFT to get this one. You had to have a board ape NFT to get this one. And you needed a mutant ape to get this one up here. This guy right here and this guy right here were public set. So anybody could have went in and, and just bought those. The numbers, we don't really know. I would like to know what the numbers on these are. We don't really know. All we do know is that the quality of these joints are freaking insane. And this is actually my PFP in, in my Discord. I just did one of these joints. You know, use the side of the box. Took a picture. But, you know, we'll, we'll get to the box first, man. Because the box is, is, it needs, it deserves its own attention in its own right. You know, and... Super Plastic ain't playing on these boxes, man. These these freaking boxes are high quality artwork in their own right. Let's open them up. Yeah, see that? Super Plastic Times Board Ape Yacht Club. This is not a toy. I repeat, this is not a toy. So when you open it up, it's a this is a sliding box. So these are actually a little bit different than the packaging we're used to. But of course, you get your stickers. And they gave you a discount code that I don't even know if it's valid anymore. But if it is, go ahead and try it. Go ahead and hit up the website. Try that janky panky and see if you get yourself a 15% off discount of what they mm, got left in the store. Because after them crazy sales they had, I got to tell you, man, they, uh, they sold out of a lot of things. And when you have crazy sales like that, you are going to sell a lot. And you get a nice board Ape sticker. You don't just get the super plastic stickers. You actually get the super board. It would have been nice if we would have got a super board sticker of this guy too. But from what I've seen so far, it's mostly just this guy. And he has a sticker as well. But those are the only two board Ape stickers I've actually seen. Put that back in there. The packaging, it's it's all pretty much the same. The, the designs are a little bit different on the back. And that's where I got to, you know, take my little PFP. You see. But, yeah, that's the box. The box is dope, but this is the prize. This is what we paid for. We didn't pay for the box. We paid for the vinyl. For the board eight. I mean, in... I don't know if this camera even does this justice, but the shine on this gold is just the reflection. It's pretty wild. I mean, you can see the whole store, you know. I could use this to catch people. I could just post this up in a corner over there and I can catch people trying to steal from us. Keep an eye on them. It's that fish eye on them. It's not that good, but it's pretty good. You get, you get the gist. Just even the quality of this head is dope, you know. But yeah, it's just real nice, clean. See his earring, super clean. Like it's like they painted and did each piece on its own, and then you know somehow connected it to the rest of the figure. Cause it's like there's no there's no paint like anywhere, no sloppy paint anywhere. Like not that I've noticed. These things come, you know, very very high attention to detail and the quality is just second to none like i mean these sneakers like the detail in these sneakers is just crazy almost looks like an artifact symbol but it's a super plastic you know got them jordan one type vibes to them but it's super plastic right there super plastic baby
that Board API Club, Skull. I'm not an evolutionist. I don't think people were born from monkeys. I think that's absolutely insanity. You know, whatever. If you PFP, you want to be a monkey, you want to devolve back into that nonsense, that's on you. Me personally, I'm grateful, thankful, and blessed to be a human being. All praise Lord Heavenly Father for six days of creation, not billions of years of evolution. But yeah, this guy right here is is nasty. I mean, just look at his shirt, bro. Look at his outfit. This outfit goes together. You got all these crazy bright colors together. And it actually looks really, really good. It looks like this guy wouldn't look crazy if you actually seen him in real life rocking something like this. You know? Especially because he's blue, right? I mean, if you're blue, I guess you can pull something off like this naturally. Might not be for everybody, but yeah. So this is this guy right here. And honestly, I don't even remember his name. But it just says Board API Club NFT. Board API Club. Curtis, that's what it is. We got the Skipper Curtis and the Skip, wait a minute. Skipper Curtis and Melvin. He's just Melvin, I guess. Melvin and Skipper. Oh, wait. I could be wrong because I think the mutant ape is Melvin, to be honest with you. So we got Board Ape Skipper, Board Ape Curtis. That's what it is. Skipper Curtis. Or Skipper Curtis. I don't know. I don't know. You figure it out. But this guy, he don't got no shoes on. It's just toes, monkey toes. And these are some pretty hideous monkey toes. I mean, they look good. They, they actually, they look like hands. I guess they should, right? Monkeys kind of have hands on their feet, right? Because they didn't evolve into humans to have feet like we have. Because <laughs> evolution is a lie. But Super Plastic and Board Ape Yacht Club isn't. They definitely work together to put this nice vinyl together. And this is a beautiful piece of art, I must say. I mean, look at just, again, the, the painting, the craftsmanship. It's like, be hard pressed to find a flaw in any of it, like each button, right? Is just meticulously painted to perfection. He's even got his hair just popping out of this shirt, like if they wrap this shirt on around him somehow, you know? Beyond the painting process, it's like, how'd they do that? I don't know. I mean, it's, I guess that's why they call it super plastic. You don't really know how they put these things together. But they do. And here we have it. My guy's smoking on a stove. Even the, even the stove. You know, it looks like it comes out. It don't come out. But look at that, man. No paint imperfections in there. You would figured you might see something on his lip. Something somewhere. But nothing. It's, it's almost like they made the blunt on its own and then stuck it in there. Could have eyeballs. Look at my guy looks stone, bro. Just throw a little bit of redness in there. You know what's in this. Come on. We don't, we don't got to beat around the bush. We know what's in there. We're all grown adults here. The shorts, everything, man. I'm telling you, man. Uh, the way they put these things together, it's it's an amazing piece of art. And it's it's pretty sturdy. It's, it doesn't stand the sturdiest. I guess the legs, the feet could have been a little bit more flatter, I guess, to really get a better stick. But they, I mean, they stand on their own. They definitely stand on their own pretty good. But they're heavy. They're solid. They're not like, you know, we'll go a particle over here because he's closest. Particle's like a little bit hollow. It's got like a hollow head. You know, this guy, this guy is solid, so hollow, solid. If, if you can get that difference, I get it because I can feel it. I don't just hear it, but yeah, man, Skipper Curtis or Skipper, I don't know, Board Ape Curtis, Board Ape Skipper. Maybe it's the same, maybe it's the same guy. He's just wearing different outfits. He looks bored in all, in all of them, so we'll go with that. We'll go with the Munade next. We'll go with the Normies after. You know, 
We'll leave that box up there because the box really is kind of boring. It's not as dope as this one. Even, you know, even this box. This one's a little bit doper because it's got the, the flowers on the shirt, but it's pretty much the same thing. You know? This one I really like because of the zebra print, and this one I actually really like because of the cheetah print. The other ones are just pretty basic. And then again, here, you got this guy. You know, same same deal as the other board API club. Same figure, same molding. He's got the cigar in there. He's actually, he's actually got a green tip. So there's definitely no mistaking what my guy is puffing on here. You see? My guy got like the reddish with the gray ash. So his is burning. He hasn't lit his up yet. That's pretty awesome. That is, that is pretty dope. That's a cool little detail. In case you guys didn't see that one. You got the burning tip and you got the, just the grass popping out tip. And this, this is green, bright. This was supposed to be a mutant ape. This isn't a mutant ape. This is just a regular board ape that is green, bright green. So I see what they did there and it didn't, didn't work. But we do got some real mutant apes coming and those things look insane. Like the mutant ape, like you look at a mutant ape PFP compared to a board ape PFP and you can see the stark differences in detail. And these vinyls is, man, it really, it really brings that to life. So yeah, my guy got the all white t-shirt. So he's just clean, you know, some dark green shorts looking like, yeah, you know, here looking like the Jolly Green Giant. My guy, but he's again. I, I just love the outfits. The outfits go really good with the the color of their fur, I guess. So that's that guy. The most boring of all is boring. It's black and white. It's not even black and white. It's just gray and white. I guess it makes it even more boring. Black and white probably would have looked super dope. The gray and white looks super dope. I'm not taking that away from it. I'm just saying. Out of all of these other ones, that these super colorful ones, these loud ones, this one doesn't have much color. But even with that, like, man, just because he doesn't have much color, it's almost like you can see these lines stick out a little bit more, which brings the attention to that. Now I'm thinking like, man, did they even snap his face on? I mean, look at that, like, that's some meticulous work right there. I mean, each piece is just, put together the hat you know the hat comes off at some point for sure and you don't see no glue you know that's what's nuts like you buy some sneakers and you're gonna find glue almost all the time on a pair of sneakers you shouldn't but you do you know this guy no glue whatsoever man the feet same thing you know they're snapping these feet in there somehow and it just it's like the perfect size the perfect fit yeah, and the legs do have a little bit of a little bit of give. You know, the the legs in here, everything like they I don't know how they put these things together so perfectly, but they do it. I'm grateful. And I guess that's what happens if you were to drop something like this, you know, you could possibly lose a hand, lose you know, his midsection, his waist could fall off, his leg could fall off, his foot could fall off. Hat possibly lose an ear, the ears same thing. You look at the ears, it's like each piece is created, painted, and then put on. Man, it's, it's beautiful. And last but not least, and this is my probably my second favorite. These were the two that I ended up buying on drop. I bought two of these guys, and I bought two of the Super Wars. This is one of those super plastic joints. Cause this was a general release so anybody got to buy these i bought two of these and then i ended up buying two of these and then i ended up picking the rest off of StockX, ebay um just whatever sites i can find them on and i ended up buying them for cheaper than retail which worked to my favor which buying these for retail didn't work to my favor but no regrets i'm happy it was all part of part of the process part of the uh the experience nfts physical items it would have been super dope if these would have came with an, an nfc chip or something like that or just something where you can relate it back to the nft but if you were there you were there i was there
So I got the video to prove it. And I got the vinyls to prove it, the receipts to prove it. But yeah, here we go, man. U.S. Army, you know. So, same, same look, but with all the color, it's like you don't really see a lot of those different details. They don't just pop up automatically. You can see them when you look at them, but they just don't pop. You don't just automatically go to those. Again, he's, he's wearing the kick, so these are the only two with shoes. So the two that I ended up buying on drop day, both have sneakers. And I ended up getting uh, barefooters later. So we got the sneaker wears and the barefooters. Sneaker wears, Jordan 1s, all day. Chicago's. My guy looks like he's from Chicago. <laughs> so you got the cheetah print, and I'll show you like the box as well. I said I would, because there's the cheetah print. See what I'm saying? When you look at a board ape yacht club PFP, like hmm. there you got there you have it. Board ape yacht club PFP, brand new NFTs coming your way. Right click and save, baby. Do what you got to do. They can come closer than close. Original day never will be. We're bumping from coast to coast. Yeah, yeah. We're just trying to make you see. Nobody does it better. Yeah, now this guy gotta go right here in the middle because I mean, let's just be honest, the Bored Apes, man, they are the leaders of the class right now, so you give Give credit where credit is due. This is the very first set of Board Ape Yacht Club vinyls, exclusive vinyls, collectible vinyls, high quality, you know, artistic vinyls created by Super Plastic, courtesy of Board Ape Yacht Club. Let's get it, let's grow. Oh, yeah, the glowing trays, but that's not what I'm here to show you. This is what I'm here to show you. I mean, just look at the details on her arms, man, and, and the clothes. Then you go to one with short sleeves, you know? It's like these little details that make such a big difference. Like, even, you know, even that, like, it's crazy. And you see how smooth the arms are? y'all looking at it's going down flower with a bird on it i mean come on did you even see that bird did you know that there was a bird on this well you do now